Yet another COVID-19 variant making its way around the world. It is more important than ever to be educated about the vaccine. And joining this morning, us this morning to talk about vaccine hesitancy is Ashley Hobbs with UHC and uh, Sonia Gray uh, with ECHO, the Exploited Children's Health Organization. Ladies, thanks for joining us today. Thank you. Uh, Ashley, let me begin with you because it is more important than ever to kind of get the word out. Uh, and what is your perspective now as we're kind of talking about this new variant? Yep. So as it's been, COVID-19 vaccines are an important step in slowing the spread of the disease and are key to protecting people's health. So it's more important than ever, like you said. And Sonia, uh, talk to me a little bit about your organization and what you're providing and how you're providing information to encourage vaccinations. Yeah, thank you so much. Um, Sonia Gray, and I'm the executive director for ECHO, which is Exploited Children's Health Organization. We've been around since 1983, and our mission is to prevent and reduce the incident and impact of child abuse. And so um, when I was asked to speak on this, um, I really thought more importantly about the children and what we experienced within the last year um, with kids not being in the school system and really not being around safe adults. So this, um, you know, providing the vaccination for your your kids is going to be another layer of safety um, for their body, but also another layer of safety just for them to be in what we would say safe environments. Um, so, um, you know, if there's any type of disclosures um, that have happened within the past year, um, they are now around once again, um, safe adults. Um, you know, when our kids were isolated, um, that was a really scary time um, for the for some kids because they could be in the house with their abuser. And so providing vaccinations for your kids is once again, that layer of protection for them. But if you think about public safety, um, making sure that we keep our kids in school is also very valuable as well. Absolutely. And a question for you both, actually, what are you doing specifically within your organization? And what can we do individually to make sure that people get their vaccine appointment? Yep, so we have um, multiple departments who work with our members. We have our outreach team who's out and about creating events, having organizations to partner with that are providing the vaccines, trying to uh, meet people where they are to be able to provide the vaccines. We have our case managers who are also talking with our members. If someone um, says that they're interested in getting the vaccine, they'll help them schedule an appointment with transportation and everything. So trying to come at it from all angles. And finally, where can we go to learn more information? Uh, UHC.com slash COVID for vaccine and wellness information. All right, all great information, ladies. Thank you so much. Thank, thank you. you.